30 degrees Celsius, it's too hot for the people in Paris. Authorities have launched their heat wave plant for public transport to reduce discomfort for those traveling in the city for the Olympic Games. The plan includes distributing free hats, fans and water bottles to passengers on public transportation and in public areas to mitigate the effect of the heat. Most people don't know that half of the buses and MRT trains are equipped with air conditioning in France. With only 70% of trains offering air conditioning, travel can be challenging during the heat wave. We just tried to bring plenty of water to ensure that the baby is well hydrated and has enough clothing to stay shaded avoiding direct sunlight. I know that the city of Paris has been preparing a lot for the Olympics by adding more hydration points for tourists. We knew it was hot today, so we didn't really want to go out. We actually went out around 2 or 3 p.m. Although it was still hot, we slowly went to a cooler place and then continued our journey. We prepared that uh, the, the day uh, in Paris uh, in, uh, in advance uh, because we knew that it was, it was very hot. So we prepared the kids, uh, clothing, um, and drinking uh, the whole day. Uh. The good, good thing is that in Paris uh, we have many, many places where we can refill uh, okay. and we can have uh, like a little bit of uh, fresh uh, water. So it was, it was very, very appreciable to, to, to see that. One positive aspect is that you can drink freely on public transportation in France. The city also provides an interactive map showing where you can fill your water bottle for free at shops, five-star hotels and restaurants. I've been asked and I thought it was great to give water to anyone who needed it. We've already had people ask me for water and as the heat wave continues, probably more will. Considering that a bottle of water can cost between 3 and 5 euros at tourist locations, the map featuring fountains is also of great help. Other countries like Taiwan could also benefit from adopting this friendly initiative in the future to make travel more convenient. This is Dimitri Rias in Paris for TVBS World Taiwan.